Welcome back, this is Yama Jack, and today we got uh, Commando Suicidal Outposts. Today is Tuesday. Today is the day I finally get to go to the, uh, the cannabis dispensary and pick some stuff up and possibly give it a try. I don't know if I'll be giving it a try today or, or whenever. I don't really know the, the exact day I'll be trying it out, but I get to pick it up today anyway. So that's exciting. I, uh... I talked about it in a recent video about how I was going to be trying out some cannabis, and that video got a, uh, a dislike. It got disliked. Um, and it's kind of funny because I, uh, I talked in the video how while it's still legal and there's just nothing wrong with it, it it's the same as alcohol, and and people will, will get on you for it and then go drink some alcohol. Um, there's still like a, a stigma around it, right? Even though it's fine. Um, so it got disliked and I'm like, well, you know, point proven. <laughs> there is still that stigma around it. People still don't like it. They still think you're a pothead or whatever, right? But it's just, uh, it's just like alcohol, right? You got, you got your, um, got your alcohol, which you, you can have. I mean, I don't drink much alcohol either, right? I don't know. But, uh, we're not going to be talking about cannabis all day today, even though, I will be uh, probably, if I do try it today, tomorrow's episodes might involve some cannabis discussions, but um, I'm uh, not, really, not really talking about it all day today. I'm going to be going grocery shopping today. That's exciting. Um, I've already done a bit of shopping, not grocery shopping, but a bit of uh, shopping for some some other things. Um, hold up. So I did some other shopping, not grocery shopping, but uh, some other shopping. I got a couple of things actually, a couple of uh, big purchases. So I got first, the first purchase I made today was a uh, commission. So I finally found somebody to uh, finally found somebody to commission for my new avatar and and all of that. So. Paying a hundred bucks for that. I'm not going to talk about who they are until I actually get the commission done, um, because I I don't I don't want to give them any advertising or anything until I, I have it and it's done and I'm happy with it. Because I've never it's not uh, I don't have I've never you know nobody no, none of my friends have used them. They aren't a friend. You know I don't really want to talk about them and give them any kind of advertising until I know that they're actually going to give me something that I like. You know, not just take my money and run, which can happen sometimes. I don't think they will, hence why I gave them $100 today. Um, but, you know, just uh, not going to be not going to be giving them any marketing until until they have something. Once they once they have fulfilled it, it should be like a week or two at the most, but probably about a week. Um, we should uh, we should be totally fine to uh, to talk about it and then uh, I'll be able to show off what we got and who did it and give them some referrals and all of that perhaps um you die um but i did pay off the paid paid the 100 bucks towards it today so it is paid for i just have to uh they're gonna be doing a sketch first um and then i'm gonna tell them hey that looks like good and or you know hey that the, that looks like not good um one or the other you know and then um i'll be able to uh get them to, to like color it in and, and shade it and all of that kind of stuff it's gonna be pretty cool uh, it's good for commercial purposes and all of that so good stuff good stuff uh, it's coming along finally actually have something going for that which is is really really nice because the sooner that gets done the sooner I can start making all my new videos again and, and start putting stuff out on the new channel which I'm so excited about and then my second purchase that I made today is uh, my second purchase is I bought something that I'm super excited about. I bought an Oculus Quest 2. Now, I know, I know, people hate it because you have to sign into Facebook to use it. I know, I know, I hate it too. I, I hate it, but I really, genuinely, I don't think that there's anything on the market right now that you can get that competes with the Oculus Quest 2 just because of the convenience factor of it, you know? 
just because it's so convenient to use you don't have to have a computer and I have a computer that is capable obviously my computer is better than the like you know phone processor that they're gonna have in the the oculus quest 2 right like obviously but honestly where I'd want to use it most isn't even like in my room where my computer is I'd want to use it mostly out in the living room and then I wouldn't want to have um, like my computer moved out there or find some way to like get the link happening and there's no tethering with the oculus quest 2 when you're not on a computer you can optionally tether it too though right so if you want to play some games that require a little bit more umph, you know then uh, you can go with that but I wanted to get it because I think that um, a I think that it's gonna be really good for my weight loss um, because I uh, you know if I can play like I don't know an hour of Beat Saber a day or something like that like that's there's definitely some some benefit to be had there with regards to weight loss, right? Without uh, without a question about that. So, um, that's that's a good workout, right? Um, and then also, it just seems like fun, you know? Like, it's just fun. It's just fun, dude. And uh, yeah, and I I can hook it up to my computer if I ever want to play something like. Uh, just a regular Steam game, maybe? I don't know. I think that you can play it, but you have to... I'm not, I'm not sure exactly how it works exactly. Um, but even if it's not, like, the best VR experience around, I think it is the most accessible experience. And because of that, I think that it is the best um, VR headset on the market currently, right now. Just, just because of how accessible and convenient it is. Even though it's not, you know, objectively speaking, the best, um, like, VR experience just around. It's just like, you know, $460, nothing else. And you have a competent VR experience. Like, a, a competent. Not, not, not like, uh, you know, like a little, you know, Google Cardboard or, you know, something like that. No, 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 like an actual respectable VR gaming experience, 460 bucks, no other purchases required, you know, everything included in the box to, to have a, a very respectable um, VR gaming experience, you know, like, yeah, you can get better, but like, you're gonna have to buy, um, and this is Canadian money, 460 bucks Canadian, it's like $300 American, yeah, welcome to being Canadian, dude. Um... But uh, for like uh, for like the best VR gaming experience, you can get like an index, a Valve index, for like fourteen hundred or fifteen hundred dollars or something like that, you know. And then you can uh, go through all the effort to set up all the light boxes, and you can get all of the uh, oops, you can get all of the uh, stuff set up for that. And then uh, oh my god, am I gonna die here? Please, please no. Please, please. Okay, okay, okay. You can get all the light boxes set up. You can get uh, smack. You can get the light boxes set up. You can get your uh, things set up. You still need a good gaming computer, so you're gonna have to spend like you know another whack ton of money on that. So that's another like fourteen hundred dollars or whatever just to get um, a computer capable of actually running it competently. And you know you can go with a. Uh, a cheaper computer but you're not gonna you're not getting the full value out of that expensive gaming headset either right um, so it's just like uh, the, the the oculus quest is a nice it's it's a nice in between between the like super du duper like dirt cheap Google cardboard you know Nintendo Labo whatever kind of garbage that you can get for VR that's like super cheap gives you like a novel experience, right? And then uh, that the, the higher end, like Valve Index, and uh, um, all of those, right? Like it's it's a really really solid middle ground that does uh, everything, but but not the best, you know? It's 90 hertz, which is good. The Oculus Quest One was, I believe, capped at 75 hertz. Um, I don't know if it's 90 hertz yet. But it is going to be 90 hertz 
in the future. So you don't die, hey? That's strange. I thought that the... I thought that this one shot him in the face. Maybe you have to be, uh... Level 25 for that. Um... Not that, why do I always buy this? It's this one. Um, so anyway, I bought an Oculus Quest too, and I know that the the Facebook stuff is kind of annoying. I'm gonna maybe see if we can like jailbreak it and get it working without that, um, because that would be nice. But even then, I'm kind of just like, you know what? Who cares? Log into Facebook. They can know, you know, what VTubers I like or whatever. Okay. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But they can know what games I play and stuff. It doesn't. I don't. You know. For, for being able to have such a unique gaming experience like that, I think it's worth it. You are just I wouldn't recommend you buy it yet. Just can't see it. You know, maybe maybe after I get it and talk about the experience of it a little bit more, I might uh, might recommend it. But um, for right now, I'm definitely not in the recommending camp. Um, it's going to be so nice to have, though, honestly. Like, even just for, like, sitting at my computer, having it plugged in via, like, an Oculus Link cable or whatever. Um... And then, uh, you know, being able to uh, play like tabletop simulator or something like that on uh, on it is is going to be very very nice. Um, so I'm I'm super super excited about it. It's it's like, and I, I can like you can share it easily, right? So like, me please, we can do this. 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 Um, so like you know, uh, an in index you can't really share it as easily either, right? Like, my sister wants to play Beat Saber and stuff as well. Um, you know, she also wants to play some of the VR games. And if I had an index, I'd have to invite her into my room and then whatever, do it. Can you do it, please? I might have to invite her into my room and then make sure everything is, is okay for her to be in here and blah 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 blah. You know, hide all of my dildos and stuff, right? <laughs> I'm kidding. I wouldn't hide them. Um, but you gotta, you gotta make sure that that everything's good, and you have to like, I don't know. It's it's, just, it's easier to share. Like when with the Oculus Quest, I could just pick it up, take it upstairs, and be like, here, clean off the the bits that you care to clean, which is gonna be like most of it. And then, um, you know, when you're done with it, just give it back to me. I don't have to like bring her around, or if I want to give her like a proper gaming experience, I don't have to like. Bring all the light boxes to her. Bring her to the light boxes. Like I can just take the physical headset and the the controllers and just be like, boom, there you go. Have fun. Go to whatever room you want and play. You know, like it's just it's just simple. Um, and no other game, no other VR headset does that. These like right now, no other VR headset does that. At least at least not good. You know what I mean? Like no other VR headset out there is doing that at like a good 90 hertz with a decent resolution no other headset does that there are plenty of other headsets out there that um what are we on outpost yeah plenty of other headsets out there that uh will give you a vr headset of uh, a vr experience on the go but nothing that gives you like an acceptable vr experience on the go you know what i mean i don't know i'm just i'm super excited about it, it comes on november 13th is when the estimated delivery time is i'm super excited I'm so 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 excited. You are here to clean out and here I have uh, I have actually Eyes never open. played anything in VR before. Yeah, nothing. Not not a single thing. I haven't had. Uh, um, I have not even like really watched 3D movies in theaters before. Really, right? Like, like I'm coming from a position of exclusively 2D media, <laughs> uh, and I'm gonna be experiencing this. So it's like. You know, if, if, you've, if you've tried the the index or whatever, maybe you can't settle for something that's worse, right? Like, maybe maybe you're like, yeah, like, I've, I've seen how good it can be. I can't really, like, get behind going with something worse. But I've never done that. You know, this is going to be the best VR he headset I will have ever put on my face because it'll be the only one. And uh, for, for me, it'll be mind-blowing. And at the price, I can't... I can't... Uh, I did forget to buy a... Um, an Oculus Link cable, because I will definitely want that as well, um, so that I can play games that uh, I can't just on the Quest itself. Um, I don't really have the space in my bedroom to move around too much. I have a little bit of space, but but not 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 an awful lot. 
of space, really, to move around. I'd have to kind of, like, move some things around and, and make some space, and I just, I'm not really into that, so... Mostly for the sitting down games, really. Um, I'm so excited to, to play so many different things, though. I like, like, Minecraft, even, in, in VR, is, is going to be, like, so cool, and... Um... I'm gonna be excited. I'm gonna be like so excited to play like like there's Killing Floor two in VR. Um, I think I know that there is a Killing Floor like Insurgents or something like that that's in VR. Might do like a let's play on that perhaps. I don't know. Like I am just so excited to have this VR headset. You know what? Let, let, let's look up the how does the Oculus Link work? I actually don't know exactly the specifics. Oculus. Link. What is it? Let's look. Let's look it up together. PC-based VR system. Yeah. So it just it just makes it a normal VR headset on your computer, I believe. Oculus Link. Like Steam games. Yeah. No, you, you can do, like, Steam VR with the Oculus Quest through the, the Oculus Link. So, yeah. Um, if I ever want to do Tabletop Simulator, oops. Um, not this, please. I want uh, uh, that. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Um, I guess I didn't pause. Yeah, I guess I guess I didn't pause. That's okay. Um, so, yeah, like, Tabletop Simulator, um, the Killing Floor games or whatever. Uh, Minecraft, um, just like a ton of games that I'm so excited to, to be able to try out in VR, you know, like tons and tons and tons of them. Super excited to try them out. Um, hey, buddies. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just, I'm, I, I've, I've wanted VR for like ever. I just, I hadn't had the money for it. And, uh, I have the money for it now, you know, I should be saving to, to, to move out. I think that the VR, because it's going to also assist me in weight loss, or at least in being more fit, anyway, not necessarily weight loss. Weight loss is more dependent on your diet than your, like, exercise. Um, but, you know, an hour of, like, some, some good, um, Beat Saber or something like that every day would be, A, like, just fun, um, or, or even any other VR game, right? Like, it, it involves you getting up and moving around and, and being active, right? At, if, if nothing else, which is, is going to be good for me. And then it'll also just be so much fun to have. I'm, 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 I'm beyond excited. I'm beyond excited about it. I told my sister that I've ordered something that she's going to be excited about, and she's like, what is it? I'm like, oh, you're not going to know until it gets here. She's like, well, I don't care then. I'm like, well, you know, you can at least be hyped about it, but she doesn't get hyped about stuff unless I tell her what it is. <laughs> Which is, is fair. You know, it's it's fair. But, like, man, I'm so excited. I'm so, so, so excited. When it gets here, I will definitely, uh, after I use it, I will definitely, uh, tell you guys how it goes and if I would recommend it. This is, again, this is coming from the perspective of somebody who has never used any VR headset other than the Oculus Quest 2. I got the 64 gigabyte version. I think that should be fine. Um, I don't mind, like, uninstalling and reinstalling games every so often. That's that's not really a problem for me. You know, who cares? Um, the games on the Oculus Quest 2 should be designed to be small enough that that's not really a problem because, you know, they, they want people to be able to actually use it. However, since there is a bigger version of it, um, there's probably enough games that you can't fit all of them on there. Um, but I'm not going to be playing every single VR game, right? Like, A, they cost money. <laughs> you know, you're, you're, you're buying like a monitor, right? You don't get the games for free. Ho <laughs> ho! Um, you know, so it's just, uh... Yeah. I don't know. I'm, 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 I'm so excited about it, though. So those are the two purchases I've made today. And I'm, I'm so excited about both of them, dude. Uh, it's just, like, so, so cool, everything that's happening right now to me in my life. Um, visiting my grandparents later today as well. I haven't seen them in, like, a, honestly, a couple of months, which I feel really bad about. But they moved, I talked about before, and, like, 
Nobody told me where they moved to, and every time they were going, I'd be like, oh, hey, I'll come, and they'd be like, cool. And then uh, they'd leave, and I'd be like, oh, you didn't, you know, tell me when, um, and, and you didn't, like, come get me. Um, so, and I just haven't gone to visit them. Um, I, I've, I've tried a couple of times to be like, hey, can we go, like, visit them, you know, maybe this week or this weekend or whatever, and people are like, oh, hey, I don't really feel good, so we don't want to go visit them, and I'm like... I just want somebody to show me where the heck they live so I can go visit them. But uh, I'm finally, today, going to be going to visit them so that that problem is kind of gone. Um, I'm really excited about that too. Because it's nice to see them, you know. They're uh, old. And, uh, you know, we don't necessarily know exactly how much longer we'll be able to visit them while they're, you know, able to respond. Um, so... Definitely, uh, definitely something I want to be doing more often, for sure. And I talk about it with, uh, with friends, too, right? Because my grandparents, they're in, like, their 80s, right? Like, they're old. You know? And, you know, not, they don't, they're not gonna live forever. And it's sad, right, to, to think about at times, right? When, uh... When you're like, well, yeah, like I'd, I'd rather go visit my grandparents or whatever, and you know, whatever comes up in in, in discussions or or something that uh, you want to uh, that that they're probably like they don't have too much longer to to really to realistically be, you know, maybe maybe like ten, fifteen years, you know, at the at the high end, <laughs> like really really high end, being super generous. Um, cause they're like in their 80s, you know, like how many, how many people who are like 100 years old do you see walking around? You know, not, an awful lot, <laughs> right? Um, so people are always like, oh, that's so sad, I'm so sorry to hear that. I'm like, it's not, like, it'll be sad when eventually it happens, for sure, right? Like, yeah, but at the same time, like, I don't know, I guess, I guess you just kind of accept it, you know? It's just, it's just, this is the way that it is. Did they nerf Commando, or, or is it really just that important to be higher leveled on Commando? You get some perk weapon damage here. A little bit of damage there, I guess. Smack him, dude. Oh, I didn't have any grenades. Shoot. So I thought that this one shot them in the face. I thought it did. Ah, oh, you stupid siren, I hate you! Oh, you too. I hate you too, buddy. Um, I don't know. It's, it's, it'll be sad when it eventually happens, but like... Knowing that it's gonna happen, just it doesn't really get me the same way, you know? It's more of like, uh, you know, they're still here. I'd rather just appreciate that, you know? It's not really a sadness to it, in my opinion, anyway. But, anyway. Visiting them tonight, so that's nice. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done that, and I'm excited about that. I'm gonna be getting my grocery shopping done, gonna be going to the cannabis store, got my stuff finally happening with, uh... With, um... The new avatar commissions and stuff. I've got, uh... My Oculus Quest 2 coming soon. It's like, it's just all around. It's, it's all very good stuff, you know? Like, everything today, it's just, it's a good day. It's a good day. Um, other than my dream, I had a I had a weird dream. It wasn't a bad. Dr uh, I'm getting overwhelmed, dude. I just I'm not very accurate with the uh, with this gun. I don't know if y'all have noticed. I'm sure you have, but uh, <laughs> I'm just I'm not very accurate with it. I can't uh, I can't shoot stuff in the face with it too well. I can shoot stuff in the face. Just it's not very. It takes a couple of shots typically, you know. Any hoozle, any hoozle. It's a good day, you know? I had a dream, uh, our dog, we don't have a dog, but uh, in my dream we did. And our dog was dog napped while we were eating dinner, and my family just like watched it happen. And then I tracked down the people who dog napped our dog, and then I smashed their face in. And then took my dog back. That was my dream. It was a weird dream. Not a bad dream, not a good dream. Just uh, a strange one, for sure. Break time's over. A very strange one. More Zeds inbound. 
I've been reading more on Royal Road. Now we'll talk about that tomorrow. We'll talk, we'll talk about that in the next episode. We'll talk about that one in the next episode. Matriarch, I hate, dude. I hate her. You should come up right here. Okay. Okay. This is good. You want you want that perfect angle so that the, uh, the thing still burns, right? Yeah, it was like, you know, the perfect angle here so it still hits me. Not really what I was looking for so much, you know? Okay, this is fine, this is fine, this is fine. This is bad, this is bad, this is bad. This is good. Oh, I did not want to fall down yet. I wanted to lure it out and then fall. So that, uh, it would get consumed, but... It didn't quite work out that way. I know you can get right up to her, okay? I've I've discovered that. It's just as commando, it's really hard to do that, you know? Because you can't you can't back up quickly enough for her to for her to uh, like not hit you. You don't, you don't have the speed necessary for that to feel like a, a good decision, right? I gotta learn recoil management on this as well. Okay, we can just take this. Don't take that, don't take that. Grenades. A bunch of grenades should do the trick here. Yep. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I can't I can't not focus on the matriarch fight, okay? I'd love to be able to commentate on it, but as the commando it's it's a really tough fight, okay? It's a hard-fought fight. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Perfect. This doesn't guarantee us a win, but it gets us closer than... Uh, than we could, we could ask for, really. Just keep our health up. Just keep our health up, okay? I think that the HM Tech 501 is higher damage, even though the other one is upgraded. This should do a decent chunk of damage and then give us a heal right there. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Beautiful kill. No, dude. Oh, that was so close. <sighs> Beautiful kill. Wasn't worried for a moment. Wasn't was wasn't worried at all. Okay. <laughs> I don't like the matriarch on commando. I don't like the matriarch on commando. She sucks. Okay, well, uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> Remember to like the video if you like, and subscribe to see more of the future comedy we've made to say. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.